An upcoming NASA mission, recently postponed but still expected to fly, will have a special meaning for New Jersey scientific community and for one family in particular. When astronauts go to repair and upgrade the Hubble Space Telescope, they also will be honoring the late John Bacall, an astrophysicist whose home base was the Institute for Advanced Study in Princeton. Science and Technology correspondent Patrick Regan has that story. Scheduled for launch this week, but postponed by a computer problem, Service Mission 4 is expected to improve the orbiting observatory and extend its life. At one point, the mission was canceled altogether, largely out of concern for the astronauts' safety, but crew members are excited about the prospect. I take this just because I think that space exploration, science, the science that the Hubble Space Telescope does is incredibly important to humanity. It's answered just so many of those fundamental questions that people have been asking about the cosmos uh, since people were able to ask questions. In giving the Hubble Space Telescope a new lease on life, the upcoming Space Shuttle mission will also pay tribute in a profoundly personal way to the life of a great scientist. My husband John, John Bacall, was involved with the Hubble Space Telescope from its pre-initial days when the idea was just proposed to NASA and the Congress to put a telescope uh, in space. Many people call John and Lyman uh, Spitzer the, the fathers of the Hubble Space Telescope. Though she won't say so herself, Netta Bacall could be considered a mother of the Hubble, responsible for shaping policies and priorities to maximize its scientific results. A few months ago, she met the service mission crew at the Space Telescope Science Institute. John Grunsfeld uh, introduced himself and he started talking about John and he told me, Nate, I want to tell you, John was a real hero to me. The astronaut asked her permission to take something personal with him on the shuttle. Not just to honor John, but he said, also for me, I will feel that I have John's spirit with me up on the shuttle going to the Hubble. And I talked to our kids, and then we thought that we were going to send our wedding rings, John and my wedding rings together, up to the Hubble. So for us, it will be a uh, especially moving thing when the shuttle gets launched to the Hubble, because not only will it make the Hubble uh, life continue, hopefully for another decade or so, but we will also see sort of John's spirit go, go up to the Hubble. Patrick Regan, NJN News, Princeton.